Good morning, New York traders. Privateer FX coming at you. Oh, it's the 14th of May. Pretty quiet, risk on type of day so far in Europe. Uh, sterling yen, really the only mover of note. Uh, up through 50, been as high as 94. This looks oddly like it's going to get through this 200 day here and this high here. Uh, 130, 149.31. Um, so we're, we're long sterling yen and we are, let me just mute this, and we are looking to uh, trade from the long side sterling yen. Dollar yen as well is kind of creeping up. Nothing great here until we get to this 110.02, uh, but you might want to try some pre-longs, say if we get through 75 and the attraction gets a little bit stronger. Oddly, Euro Swiss is bid. Middle East is about to go to war. Euro Swiss is just plotting higher. This looks like it's going to break 120.05 either today or tomorrow, which leads me to believe that Dollar Swiss is going to turn here and also move higher. Sneaky long might be, I don't know, if we get a pivot at 20 or 200 hour. I don't know. I suck at Euro, as Euro Swiss and Dollar Swiss, so I don't even want to give you a suggestion, but looks like it's turning. Um, keep an eye out on that. Aussie yen, as you can imagine, is near its highs. CAD yen the same, up almost a half a percent. Uh, in general, it's been risk on. Equities have done nothing, though. We were at 40, now we're at 35. Looks just quiet on equities. Could go either way, but we're certainly playing on the bullish side up here. No real downdrafts. Um, no real downdrafts at all recently. Uh, going forward, what are we looking at? Specifically, like I said, we're, we're long, core long, sterling yen, um, and we are, oh yeah, and we're looking at cable. Cable printed uh, 135.97, which is pretty neat, because the high on Friday was 96, and then we have this very important BOE, pre-BOE high, 136.17. These look like they're going to get taken out. I don't know why Sterling's bid. I guess people are short. Um, you could draw a lot of little patterns here or whatever, but as you can see, we're just higher lows, sideways, higher lows. Uh, now we've put in this sort of double top. This is the neckline down here, 135.32. So if you're going to try core longs, this is your cut. Uh, or you can just wait till it breaks, add through the figure, and then add again maybe at 20 for a move back to 136.50, 137. I don't know. Technically, this looks very good. Obviously, it doesn't make tons of sense uh, in the current circumstances with uh, Theresa May flailing like some sort of money python skit. But, um, you know, FX often doesn't make a lot of sense. A lot of guys are going to say inverted head and shoulders. A lot of guys are going to say what I just said, higher lows, higher highs. Uh, I think this trade is, is probably going to happen, so it's a focus. Sterling yen, sterling dollar, right-hand side. A lot of bad news in cryptos recently. A lot of guys are slamming it, saying, oh, why? I don't understand. Iceman from the Big Short. Iceman from the Big Short said he doesn't understand cryptos. What's the purpose? We're quite happy to play the same game we always play. Uh, we're going to be down here 72, 62, 5200 in Bitcoin, collecting longs. Um, still ways away. That's... Uh, thousand dollars away so it's over 10 percent away but keep it in mind get your mind ready for that stuff and we will see how that goes anyway back to fx sterling yen and sterling dollar right hand side today
Good luck, peeps. I will see you tomorrow. Bye.